What's up ladies and gentlemen, it's Lestat, your main host in the co-event of the Beaner Games and Trump of Vivia. And in today's cl class, we're going to watch two little Mexicans fight off 50 little white boys and see why the black kid survived. And to get off the note, what's up boys and girls, <laughs> Lestat here, and I just want to do a quick look over of all the editing I did for my new recent um well it was the first upload I have on this channel of my Star Wars skip yes I understand the acting's not that well and everything's not that good the editing's pretty okay but I'm still learning and all that and I'm still in the beginning productions of learning for my actual film so this is just me learning and experimenting with it for sake so I'm probably gonna get a lot of hate, um, hate on that video hopefully not hopefully a lot of support but yeah, I'm just going to do a quick overview for you guys on on that video that I made. Okay, so let's set this straight. What I did was, of course, the audio. I'm not going to have to go overview of audio. You can just think of it right there. Um, lightsaber effects, blah, 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 lightning effect audios. But I'm going to go over the actual effects and editing I had to do. So what I did was, well, Adobe After Effects. And I see right here... Um, a bunch of shots and they're the same ones over and over uh, these are the ones I could edit or I could edit all of them but these are the actual clips that I did and then these are the final finish and then these are the ones that are editable that I um just for organization it's easier that way for me but this is the first shot whenever um it shows the sun and then it comes down it's the first shot and then this is pretty basic I didn't really have to do anything but put my own um color correction in and without the color correction I'm gonna show you guys right now oh uh, do, 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 do shot one okay so without the color it's like that basically it still looks sort of good but with the color correction added it looks a lot better has more color detail but yeah that's um all I did for the first clip is basically a color and then the second clip, um, all I did was a color as well, cause not really a need for anything else in this one. So shot two. Uh, no, shot two. There we go. This one I did the same thing. And you see, it's like this. And then I just put in my personal color correction. Um, I saved and it made it like this. A lot better if you see and um sorry this is not probably as I thought you would be I'm just doing a quick overview for people on that quick skit I did and the special effects and then the scene three with the lightsaber um there goes a lot within making the lightsaber effect but this is just a quick look of it all I'm gonna do is just render it out and you can see the lightsaber effect it does a small process for making a lightsaber effect but this is basically it but this is just a quick playthrough of the actual effect whenever I was done editing it and then when I finished editing it you just drop it atop of the actual clip and then blend it as in screen and then it goes over and then you make sure you just line it up with the timing and everything right but this is just a quick little um, a little look at the editing effect I did for the lightsaber I think it looks pretty good honestly I, I like it and then the shot four, I'm pretty sure y'all know this shot when it first brings out the light when it first brings out the lightning. And a few editing comes in here, this one too as well. You gotta do the um, ugh, I can't really talk right now for some reason. But okay, so I have the original shot and then I did the lightning effect shot and then I composed uh, made it into a own composition and then um did all the other effects to make sure it worked right. And then after I did that, um, I added lighting as well by creating a mask on it. As you can see, if I click on this, there's a mask around um, the me. I'm the guy in the mask, but there's a uh, around the figure. I'm gonna say figure basically. There's a mask around the figure for the lighting effect. Um, that's when that comes in. So because you want to have the lighting on, because you're shooting lightning, so you want the lighting effect on. And then shot five. Um, there's another mask for the lightsaber because I don't want it and hitting the lightsaber um, that bad like going over it completely I just wanted to sh um, fade it out a little so I put another mask over the lightsaber until it went out of the screen as you see and I just put it there but this is another shot whenever um, 
I get hit with the lightning shot. Lightning. You can see you guys probably know that um, from an actual thing if you watch an actual skit. But all I did was um, also compose the lightning and then made the shot. Um, I don't know why there's two shots. Oh, yeah, the shot um, for the lighting. I should have done. I don't know why I, I redid this one. Uh, I should have put a layer for the, a different solid, I mean, for the lighting, but you can also duplicate the layer. Uh, for the lighting, but yeah, this is um, a quick. You can see the lighting is lighter right here than it is for over here. That's because of the lighting effect for the that I did for the lightning. And then shot six is whenever I'm moving forward doing the lightning. So let's just compose this real quick as you can see. This one might take a little longer, so whenever it's um, composing real quick or rendering a quick render, uh, you can see in the background, anyways. But honestly, honestly, this took me a long while. Uh, people will be like, "It's so short, though. It's only six clips or shots, and um, they're not that long. They're barely probably they're probably like under ten seconds long at most. Ten seconds long, and like, well, there's a lot of editing had to go into it. Some of them you have to go frame by frame to get it right." Or if you want to do a better job, you gotta go in detail, go and zoom in. You gotta do the curving and everything. This is just a small skit, but for my actual film later in the future, because I'm still writing the script, is gonna actually be very in depth. It's gonna take a long while to get it, cause you gotta do frame by frame and um, other effects. And but honestly, like this is just a small skit. Practice and just practice my special effects. Um, see how they work. Get used to them. Get the memorization down on how they do it. On how to get it done actually still and honestly like just make sure I have everything right so whenever we actually get into the editing after the film after filming it uh, we could just get it done like faster than it should have been um, than it should be if we just started seeing the special effects and practicing it then because I'd rather practice it now so whenever I have people help me and they don't understand it or they want to learn more in that certain area of work then I'll teach it myself because I already have worked on it in the beginning and a lot from it so I'll probably do a lot. Of I'll probably do some special effects tutorials on lightning, or um, there we go. It's composed partly. Sometimes it stops composing halfway there. I don't know why, but here's a quick look at it. But um, I'll probably do some special effects on like blaster special effects or like lightsaber special effects, gunfire effects, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But I do some tutorials on that if you guys want that in the future. But yeah, this is a quick one, and then these are all the shots right here. And um, these are the finishing touches, or the finishing shots. So I could just um, render them for to go into editing. And now we're gonna go to the editing phase. Just gonna exit out of that, and then we're gonna go to Sony Vegas. And welcome to the editing portion of my skit and honestly a lot of went into the editing than I expected so let's just uh, okay okay just take a quick a, a quick look at this um, okay so I you see I have all the clips right there and then start getting the introducing like uh, Lestat introduces and then our Lestat represents or some crap like that forgot what I put in the um, skit and then when you go down here that's when we get all the audio in and the mixing of the audio for this um, just for this short skit so you see I got all those um, frames or all those little clips I some I cut some of them to make it a little better I think in my perspective and then when you go down it's with all the audio that I put into it and editing of the audio just for this simple minute basically a little over a minute um, skip it's not that long of a skip but a lot of editing special effects goes into it and it might not seem like a lot but trust me it is now imagine doing a film that's like a two hours to two and a half hours long so I can imagine how long that's gonna be but yes I did all the special effects and then um, the editing and it took me probably like two days because I also have school and then I gotta do homework and then I got other stuff to do but yeah, this is um I'm gonna graduate soon, so I'll get my film done faster that way. But yeah, this is all the overview of what I did for the special effects and editing for my film. 
and hope you guys enjoy it and comment like subscribe and comment what you guys want to see next in future videos and hope you guys see you guys in later so yeah don't forget to tell your friends too share my skit and put your own personal opinions about the skit and what you can find that you think will be better or what you think will be good for another skit or special effects in the future so hope you have a wonderful day later